you've turned on to rock and roll. Yeah, we do have Crybaby next. I know that there is kind of an order that you go through things, like kind of like almost mm. like NF or like a, there's a journey. But um, we're going to kind of test the waters and see if this is something you guys, you know, consistently want us to do. Yes. But uh, somebody did comment. They're like, you know what? I would do Crybaby next. That would okay. probably be the, yeah. the best one. So um, this girl is just amazingly talented and just from her conceptualization to her singing and just everything. Yes. So yes, it does look like we have kind of a longer video tonight. So maybe we're going to get a little theatrics that will happen maybe at the beginning. I was, of the wa end or I something. was wondering. Yeah, but yeah, dude, I'm just, I'm excited, man. So I think we should, you know, I don't have anything. Yeah. Let's, let's yeah. just get into it. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back. You music junkies. I'm Eric. I'm the hip hop head. I'm Kyle. I'm the metalhead. head. Hey, brothers, the react to shit. So let's do that tonight. We have Melanie Martinez cry baby with the lyrics pulled up. Oh, um, okay. Um, the okay, fuck? yeah, just like the, yeah, all right. That was in one of the videos we watched. out there. Oh yeah, what the fuck is going on? It's getting ticking. Yeah. Getting fat. Oh. Uh, oh, what the fuck? Kid lighting her cigarette. Is that supposed to be the doctor? Oh yeah, he was signing them. Literally, he wrote "cry." Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Was that the dollhouse in the corner? It might have been. This is so the uh, the sound the the sound that I was talking about on Dollhouse. Mm -hmm. It it's definitely like again it's not the exact same thing, but it is very much present in her like style of music mm -hmm. and then, you know like that I guess maybe like kind of circusy thing and yeah. stuff. But I think already this actually might already be my 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 new favorite by her. Yeah. Now the fact of just lyrically and the fact of like her how she sounds while she's singing and how she kind of ends words. Yeah, man, this girl is super talented. Just how do you think of things like someone turning on the handle to the faucet in your eyes? Oh, you know God, they're, yeah. they're pouring out where everyone yeah. can see. Like it's just it's words and how you phrase things. Like, dude, she's she's amazing. Yeah, and it's I think that what's interesting about this is that you know like kind of when the 
melody started to come in because this is something we've talked about before is that you know sometimes melody can kind of like hit me wrong at first sure. until i hear how it like resolves and i go oh this is the pocket that we're in or this right. is what we're doing dude i love her flow her me too her, her flow on just lyrics and melody is just it is so yeah. damn good it's it's awesome and this entire music video is just bananas. Like, cause it's like, yeah. I've like, it's kind of that mentality where it's like, Oh, you know, it's going to be weird or quirky because that's like her style or this mm -hmm. is what she does. This has elevated everything that we have seen so far. And it's just like, dude, this is dude. This is awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Agreed. So, all right, let's get back into this. Do it. Baby, cry. Demented Toy Story right now? She laughed through your tears. So your tears are mine. And it's flipped to, to now I instead of yeah. This borderline, like it sounds like something that should be on the radio. It has that yeah. bop to it, like, yeah. dude, but it's so different. Oh. And water's coming, coming tears are coming out of the, oh my God. Because it's in the doll. Okay. Yeah. Very different, even for her. Yeah. I feel like, and uh, yeah, I, I don't know what I cut around, guys, because we actually had some technical difficulties. But I was saying earlier in the fact of like how she uses words and the fact of the the faucet being in her eyes and mm -hmm. being turned on, and then you know how she a couple of times already. I I feel like that maybe she does this a lot, but in a good way. But how you have the, the the lyrics and stuff one way and how it flips just that little bit at the end to yes. like make it just that much different. Yeah, I like when people can do that, even if they do it a lot, but if they do it correctly, mm. you know, again, that kind of gets into that category for me where like it can get corny mm -hmm. if you do it too much or like the, not the right way. And I don't know how sure. else to explain that, but no, she's really good at flipping the song around and giving it like, you know, different meaning and stuff like that as well. But mm. no, she is somebody that I am super stoked to keep going through. Yeah. I mean, and as we've been saying guys, that if you want more of Melanie, yeah. let's get a thousand likes on this video that we, that way we can see something physical and know. And I think that you guys are probably going to crush it again. Like you did last time. Cause it seems like you guys really adore what she's doing and yeah. want to see us react to it. Um, but man, I just, 
again, like I was more of like visually taking in what was going on. Like this, this video was disturbing. Like it's because mm -hmm. it's, it's not even that like anything that aggressive really even happened. Like, cause I would argue that Mrs. Potato Head had more graphic nature in it. Sure. than This one did. This one is unique on its own. Like it's, it's just, there's this very odd thing about like just being young and like seeing, you know, a, um, an, like an older girl, like, you know, like portraying that and like, you know, fitting into that character and doing mm -hmm. these things, the toys coming alive, uh, the entire birth scene that we got to see, like all that stuff. And like, especially the rabbit too, which I'm not sure what that means yeah. or, or like what the symbolism is there. But, um, I do know that there, like, again, there is like a journey that we can kind of follow. So, I mean, as far as like what we should do next, or like maybe if we're going to fill in gaps or maybe go in the correct order or whatever, seems like you guys are enjoying this. So give us a list of things in order of how we can go through yep. her stuff and we can figure out whether or not we're going to be able to move forward. Yep. So, cause I'm, this is very interesting because I've heard that Crybaby is the main character of her story. Okay. okay so I'm assuming, All right. I assume that Crybaby probably grows up or whatever. And sure. then like, things happen. So sure. God knows if like dollhouse is like part two or something, or like there's like, that's some kind of what I'm wondering. Right. So, right. But no, man, this is just, this is incredible. I'm, I'm again, we love bold artists and I'm happy that she's able yep. to do some stuff that maybe people would, uh, judge it first and have a wrong, you know, um, assumption over, but dude, mm -hmm. no, she's being artistic. She's being bold. And like, whether or not it's like what you agree with, it's like, dude, no, she's standing strong. Agreed. You know, Agreed. so dude, 100%. This was awesome. Yeah, guys, this was incredible. I really hope we get to go through more. And remember the people that work on the fast and the furious movies are embarrassed at what they do. And if you liked what you saw, <laughs> you know what to do. Hit the like button and subscribe. That way you never miss an upload. And watch us do it. It's to stuff. Comment down below if you want to see anything else. We'll get to it as soon as we can. And we'll see you next time. <laughs> Cheers. Adios.